This is a short ex um, snippet from a video I've done a long time ago. I will link that video somewhere in this video about it. Um, so hi, this is Brenda from my Wee Wee Prince Cradle. I'm quickly here to do a video for Julie. Hi Julie! Julie did a video for me. She's the Country Cottage and I will link her channel as well. I'm here to show her and everyone my Tina Kiwi babies. Now I'm not feeling very well. I'm trying my best to speak okay, but um, my throat is really, really itchy and I'm still not feeling well, but I'll get through this. Uh, these three that you see in front, that's Hunter, Hunter Riley, and Hayden James. And these two are my twins. And that one is Bronte Selena. Now, these two were made by the same artist, a Canadian artist, and same with that one. <laughs> she was made by um, an artist's daughter. So, um, I will link videos to the box openings, and within those box openings are also the information um, of those two. Well, I might not have these two anymore. But I do have two other Tina Kiwi babies. One I was trying to sell for a really long time and she's still packed away in her box. But I will insert some pictures. So those pictures are the Freya kit and uh, I named her Adrienne Ripley. And um... I she came to me bald and she came to me with no eyelashes and that was my attempt back then to create eyelashes for her now because I'm fair skinned and really dark haired that's what I liked for my eyelashes I love I love her so but I couldn't sell her for the longest time so I don't think I will sell her anymore because um I, I just want to keep her in my collection and keep her as is. That's how I created her eyelashes and they're not the best. It's just a beginner's point of what I did. But um, I still love her and I still want to keep her. So that's why. But she's still hidden in her box until I find room for a proper place for all of them. But um, my fourth Tina Kiwi baby who is not here either he is the Jack, I'm pretty sure, Jack by Tina Kiwi. But I took him apart, and I have a video of my Frankenstein baby that I used his limbs and his body, and I used a different head. Now, the reason why I don't have that head is because I wanted to root him. And I'll show you my progress. This is her, actually. Now, she, um, she did come to, or did I even, no, I did her eyelashes. Yeah, they're not the best. And I tried rooting her, and obviously I'm not done. But, um, I don't know. I tried my best rooting her. I'm not finished, as you can see. I'm not done at all. But, um, and it's very messy. I don't know what I'm doing. This is my first attempt at trying to root, um, but that's her. I forget what I named her, but I do like, like she does have very light, light painted hair, which I do like, but I just wanted to try rooting. And I thought that this one would be awesome. So, but yeah, I gave her those, if you can see those eyelashes. So, but I, I named her Jerrica Snow, um, but I also used the name Jerrica on another doll, so I need, she is nameless <laughs> right now, or he, I don't know yet, but um, one day I will finish rooting 
That's my job. It's horrible. I know. It's not the best. I have. I am not following any line or anything. Now I wish I would have thought of that. I'm kind of following um, the painted hair of... Well, not really. <laughs> I just started rooting to see if I could do it. And um, I can root, but it's not very well at all. So, but these two are my twins. And... Um, the she is not a triplet and I want to show you the differences like this one here this is Hayden and he has that really wonky arm that I'm sure that Julie knows what I'm talking about Ooh, with her this guy he's he's so sweet though um see if so yeah he does not have any eyelashes or hair no painted hair nothing that's just his bald head but I do love him he's very heavy and very awkward <laughs> to hold like that and this is my open eye they are very um floppy extremely floppy but I don't mind that. She is a little bit more firm. And she was also made by a different artist. So. So here is Bronte. And she is completely different. She does have rudent um, eyelashes. And I love her painting too. She is also, if you can tell, I don't know if you can tell, but she is matted. A lot more thickly than see that guys get a little shiny and um, this girl she's not this is Bronte she does not have the same arm this one just looks but hers is like his <clears throat> but I love she's also very heavy and awkward but I love her like she has a lot more red patches which I really, really like. Let's see her feet. I love how she she is done really well. I love I love how the artist did her a lot. Um, the artist of this one, her name is Cassandra, and she I think she was only twelve, but when she did her, oh look how cute she is. Now, she's not as floppy. She has more, like, oh, she's heavy. <laughs> she's heavy to me right there, but she is not as floppy. She's more, like, stuffed. These guys, they're very heavy, but they're also very floppy, as you can see. But, um, oh, yeah, he's not as red. In fact, it looks like, well, the paint's not moving off. It's just, um, oh, so cute. But that's Hayden and Hunter, the twins. I do have clothes that they match. Um, this is Bronte. Like, she's not as floppy as the other two, but she's still pretty floppy. And I love, she is like the perfect winter baby, like with the, with the winter cheeks. I love dressing her up in her winter gear because it truly does look more authentic with that red. But the, oh, but those two guys are also equally beautiful. <clears throat> So yeah, those are my five Tina Kiwi babies. Um, one day I will find um, Adrian and bring her up. Um, as for right now, it's just I'm not feeling very well, so I don't really want to go down and start digging around and stuff. I know where her box is, but it's in the back of all these other boxes and bins and drawers. <laughs> 
So I prefer not to try and reach and get her. So hopefully you can understand. But one day she will come back out. And she's, um, did I mention she's also bald? Yeah, I would love to try and root her too. Um, in the future, maybe. I don't know. We'll see. I do have reborning supplies. But I haven't even tried to reborn. Because I have no room. I have no time. Um, when I do have time off work... I just like to spend time with these babes. So um, I'll pan over and show you uh, Carly. Carly is on the couch. She is so beautiful. And Rebecca, I finally put her in clothes. Show you. Rebecca's hair is amazing. These two are sisters. Oh, and there's my big girls. So yeah, I hope that you like this small collection, Julie. Uh, Tina and Kiwi sculpts are really adorable. I agree with you that I do like them a lot. Um, actually, I like a lot of sculpts. So anyways, guys, hope that you're having a great day. Thank you so much for being here. I love it so much. And until next time, guys, bye. Hi guys, love you, bye.